While the continent bled engulfed by war, Skellica bloomed under Ceres's enlightened rule. Unlike those who had come before her, the young queen did not raid foreign shores, looking instead to her people, tending to her land. The island-bound nation prospered, though its fangs of yore were dulled. Cyrilla Fiona Ellen Rhiannon, heir to Nilfgaard's throne, chose the life of a witcher on the path. Geralt taught her all he knew, every skill he possessed, then each set off on their own. Berg 7th, 1273. Tuesday, Skellige became an expert herbalist on Skellige and an expert on druid pranks by the way. for news of its whereabouts. A grateful owner willing to pay a finder's fee. Clan Brockvar's emblem. Crate doesn't look at all like it was smashed in a storm. Someone chopped it open with an axe. Let's see what's it worth to the owner. What's that? They chain you here. I didn't like old Greta. Uh, no, but I didn't want his death. Free me, please. I was framed for murder. Hmm. Guess I believe you. Thanks. I won't forget this. I've no way to pay you, but if we ever meet again, I'll get you back for what you've done. Can you walk? Don't fret about me. I just need to rest a spell. Then I'll be fine. Thank you for your help. Cruel and unusual as punishments go. Maybe someone in the harbor can tell me what's going on. That damn the dogs. You don't look like one to haggle. You of Clan Brockvar. True and blue. Red and born. Think I found something might belong to you and your kin. Cargo from a longship that wrecked north of Ard Skellig. Ach, the Hemdel's wrath must be. Sailed out to raid the continent's coast. Must be a month now, never came back. But listen, you happen across a sword among the wreckage. Decorated, ornate. Belonged to the captain. His kin would surely want it back. Yeah, I found it. Glad to give it back, provided the finder's fee is fair. Naturally. Wouldn't have it any other way. Thanks. 
Hurry, and you might be able to recover the rest of the cargo. We'll do just that. I folk to round up, but thanks for bringing the news to us. Don't mention it. So long. Ah, shame about Breton. He was a good man. Aye, and he didn't drink much. As for that poor son, Yorg, chaining him to the rocks, that was too big a punishment. Should have lashed his skin off. Don't say that. My brother was good. Quiet, dear. You don't know what you're saying. Your brother was a vile man, a criminal. The quicker you forget him, the better. Be gone, man. Let us mourn in peace. What happened here? My brother? He chained him to the rocks? Because of me? Why because of you? Because... Because... I didn't like my uncle Greter. He was fat and stank. Once... I told my brother that uncle... Did bad things to me. York flew in a rage and killed him. Then they caught him and tied him to the rocks. That's how your laws work. A murderer has to be punished, even if he killed to save someone else. But... But... I lied to Jorg. Uncle did nothing to me. He stank and I didn't like him. That's it. And now... Now Jorg will die because of me. Your brother will be fine. I freed him. He's bound to come and find you soon. Truly? Thank you, thank you. I'll never tell another lie, I swear it. See you not from round here. What's brought ye to speak, Arog? Heard you've got a job for a witcher. Aye. My sister's near drilled a hole in me, got pestering me. I hung her notice, hoping she'd let up. Truth be told, didn't really expect anyone to take an interest. What's this about? My sister's betrothed. He's disappeared. Folks say he done a runner. Sis claims she saw a beast carry him off. Sensing you just don't believe your sister. They had their ups, they had their downs. Nils, thoroughbred skirt chaser. And Brit's just not easy to be around. But family's sacred. You willing to look into this? I'll see what I can do. Want to talk to your sister first off. Britt and Nils had their favorite spot, cliffs north of the village. Ever since he went missing, she's been wandering about there. Thanks. I'll go see her. Need to talk to you. <laughs> Leave me be. Did you see Nils die? I, I, I saw a shadow. Great wings, like a cloud passing over the sky. Then I heard him scream. Something grabbed him, lifted him up, then flew off towards the caves on the shore. But he was alive, screaming my name. I'll look into it. Gotta explore those caves Brit mentioned. Brit doesn't sound like she was making things up, but to lift a man. Must be an enormous beast. A royal griffin, maybe. Doesn't look like the right place. But what are these women doing there? The white-haired one. Who is he, I wonder? A warrior. What do you need? You aim to enter the crypts? Maybe. Why are you here? Came here to cut nails. Nails? Of corpses. Don't you know? Wraiths use nails to build their cursed longship. So you're hoping you can make them run short of materials? We would if we could get in the crypts. But there's ghosts inside. Would you tend to them? Fine. I'll see what I can do about the ghosts. <laughs>
bastards could have used serious help here. Took care of the ghosts. Crypt is safe. Thank you for your help, white-haired one. We'll make a sacrifice to Freya in your name. Well, maybe Freya will help with Brit's missing husband. Stinks of carrion. Necrophages. Ah, that stench. Drowners couldn't possibly lift nails into the air. Melusine, the mad and dangerous Lady of the Depths. Clearly used to be worshipped here. Strange scale color. Not your everyday siren. Same scales as on the altar. Melusine cult didn't appear out of nowhere. The kitten has been living here a while. Went into hibernation some time ago, but it's awake now. And it's hungry. dropped him from high up. Brit wasn't lying. Quick and painless. Master Witcher? Found an old echidna in a cave on the shore. Tough beast, but I killed it. So Brit spoke true? A beast took Nils? And killed him. Body's in the cave. I'll have to fetch it. Witcher, would ye mind telling Brit what happened to her betrothed? Fine. I'll talk to her. It's the least she deserves. Feel like a damn fool now, not believing me own sis. Take this. Hard work deserves payment. Farewell. Need to talk to you. <laughs> Leave me be. Your betrothed is dead. An echidna captured and killed him. Nels. <laughs> this won't bring him back, I know. But I avenged him. Killed the beast. Thank you. Knew all along he was true to me. And so I'll vow to be true to him. For the rest of my days. Take this gold. Tint much, but I want you to take it. Thank you. Take any coin I can get. Doesn't come often in my profession. 